Kai coming out strong off the front leg. Referee wants more activity. Zhang's for the first headshot. Well short, but very, very fast. We're just getting the measure of each other right now. Well, an exchange there. Tata goes high with a hook kick. No point scored. Zhang holding on to that centre ground, edging forwards, trying to push her opponent back towards the end of the court. Tata with the weight on the back leg, looking to come off the front there. to start <laughs> nice combination there by Tata coming off the back leg not scoring zone though got Zhang on the butt <laughs> Zhang tried to come over the top of Tata's check his first round <laughs> no point score there but that's nothing to do with the uh, the new PSS system <laughs> so it's got a different look this new PSS by Dado and it's uh, different settings we've listened to the advice and the request by the take on the community A bit of negativity around it was that the it's been introduced um, without many of the teams knowing about it or any of the teams for that matter so there's not a time to prepare on it and that could be the factor which determines whether or not this will be put forward to Rio it will be the Dado system in Rio both the head guards the PSS head guards and the protective scoring system the body protectors Second round, no points as yet. Cautious start. Tata comes out fast. Good mobility by Tata. Nice headshot there by Zhang. Goes up there, cut underneath. Sounded like there's an impact, but actually Zhang's signaling that it was to her arm. Tata looking for the counter now. Exchange lots of movement, but no scoring techniques. Zhang, both players looking for the counter, which is a little bit difficult when your opponent's not throwing the techniques. The referee will be giving Kyungos with a little burst of activity. And they're very short, very fast, and very powerful, but neither of them getting through to score the points. The referee wants more activity. There you go, signals again. I think we might even see some Kyungos in the next round if they uh, don't step it up a little bit. Tata definitely more cautious than she was in the first in the quarter final against Johansson from Sweden. <laughs> Zhang looking for the counter, but doesn't really seem to be prepared to do anything when Tata comes in for the attack. Trying to set herself 
for a kick, but she really doesn't seem to be getting the footing that she wants. Be quite interesting that be Zhang seemed quite frustrated there. And he was getting quite warm now. You can see that not just on the athletes but on the coaches as well. It's humid. And obviously, like you say, we're in Mexico City, so we're at altitude. Obviously, everyone's in the same boat. So not enough exchanges, not enough scoring opportunities there. What do you think you can see? What do you think you if you can see the scoreboard on the field of play, play. There's, there's a 10 second countdown where you can see the parts of seconds as well, which is part of the new Dado technology. So, third round, no points as yet. Similar, very, very, very similar style with these athletes coming off the front leg. Quick and powerful, but not scored, scoring as yet. <laughs> Qatar goes high. Big shot, but not very convincing to be truthful. Qatar does seem to be the more, slightly more aggressive of the two athletes. Exchange there, some power in those techniques, but well covered by both. Qatar does seem to be looking for the scoring opportunity. There you can see the weight on the back leg, raising the front leg for the counter off the front. Zan keeping in that even stance with the weight, evenly distributed between both either leg. So looking to come off a front or back, but not really committing either way. <laughs> Referee wants more action, he wants to see some points. As we all do. Back kick counter by Zhang. Well short. <laughs> Zhang looking for the counter, but really has a little bit of difference. There's shorter leg range, so doesn't look like she's going to get it. So can Tatar score in this last minute? Tries the back kick, Zhang tries to counter back but well short. So it looks like we're going to be going another golden point round. Almost playing for it now, it's a little bit frustrating. No point scored. It's a little bit disappointing when we get to the third round where neither player seems to have committed enough to try and score the points. Let's see if it's a little bit different in this golden point round. Turkish coach, Sehin. A bit more dynamic than what his player is right now. Tatas, we've seen her do some incredible headshots. She's very, very strong in the quarterfinals. So, still my favourite for going into this golden point round, but not convincing so far against Hua Zhang from China. So, the first semi final of the female 67 kilogram division. Body weight back, looking for the front leg. Did she get through there? She tries to get off the back leg that time and takes a point on the counter. Coming off the back leg, Zhang couldn't get the leg range right when she did attack. It wasn't convincing, and Tata punished her. And she earns her place in the first semi final.
of, by winning the first semi-final and she will be up against Abinaya from France or Anastasia Baryshnikova from Russia. So not the most uh, convincing performance by Nur Tatar. She's going to perform a lot stronger, but she won't care. She's there. She's got her place in the final. And Wa Zhang will be in the bronze medal fight-off. 